Hey there folks, this is Bobo the Vulture. I've uh, edited my broadcast day apparently. Um, admittedly it has been a very long time, but I think it's been long enough. Let's play Castle of the Winds on what is clearly a new operating system because it's got uh, all Vista E Cleary looking uh, panels and crud up there. Um, it's actually, yeah, this is just a different computer, don't have the own setup. Uh, let's look in the inventory. I'm pretty sure I still had stuff I needed to sell. Hmm. I don't need to sell all this stuff. I should sell some of this stuff. Friggin' boots of levitation. Who needs that mess? Um. Weapons shop. Yeah. Here, let's go sell. I got an axe to. I got an axe to sell with you, pal. Battle axe. Yes, give me copper. And there's nothing in this pack. I should probably just get rid of that pack. Huh? Hold on, wait. I got a wand of summon monsters. I need to give it away, give it away, give it away now. Look at all these belts. These belts are useless to me. Wand quiver belt. That actually is useful to me. Hmm. And 60, 600. I think I'll buy this one quiver belt. Yes, I think I will. And I think I will. Here, where one quiver belt is. See, it's got some slots for other stuff. I can put the utility belt on there. I can open up the utility belt. Put my wands on there. See? I am way ahead of the game here. Wand, wand, wand! Never even knew these things existed. This is great. Uh, except for the fact that apparently it's too heavy for my wand quiver belt. Oh boy. Oh boy. Boy, just got on here and I already am a mess and everything. I'll be messing up again. Alright, although I think the uh, solution to this is opening up the other belts, getting rid of whatever is in these other belts. There is nothing in these other belts. Although they do all weigh something. I think the time may have finally come for me to take this endless loop of belts and take them off of at least off of the utility belt. That way we can put some more wands onto the wand quiver. See? All good. So let's see. I'm liking that actually. That's a fantastic new little improvement. Scroll of Rune Return. Let's hang on to the Scroll of Rune of Return. So that we can return easily, because I know that's been a sticking point for me. All right, got all that stuff. You know what? Scroll with attack monsters. Let's get rid of that. Detect objects. Get rid of that. Levitation. Definitely get rid of that. Another potion levitation, yes. Let's take all these, get rid of all these things so that we have at least a little. Hey, sleep monster. All right, now I've filled up my wand quiver belt and I can activate all of these wacky nutty spells. Well, I can't because uh, I haven't put the belt on. My belt loop. Silly, silly me. Now look what I got, son. Yeah, I'm digging that. Okay, folks, um, 3 slot belt, 3 slot belt, 2 slot belt, there's nothing on the 2 slot belt. Alright, folks, I know it's been fun, but it's time to get rid of these belts. Utility belt that was on here. 
there is a four slot belt on this utility belt, isn't there? No, there's not. Oh, that's right, because it's just in the inventory. Oops. Here, go away, four slot belt. All right. And I think that more or less, with one small exception, I have to go sell this one of summon monster. See? Give him a busted item. He's still happy. That's my Olaf. Gotta love him. Alright. Let's go and... Yeah, the bank is down here. So, last thing I want is smirking sneak thieves. Yes. See? We get all new error beeps now for uh, things like you receive a letter of credit good in all the town shops. Isn't it exciting? I know you're excited. I know I'm excited. You guys should be excited too. Let's save the game. Let's save it as... Let's save it as Bobo 2, because I'm not even sure that this friggin' recording is going to work. Let's save it as Bobo 4, because I'm that unsure of whether or not this is going to work. Game is saved, though. So, let's head back. Um, I get the feeling that we're going to have some sensation of foreboding as we... Yeah, chill. Runs down our spine as we pass under the archway. You know, it's been so long. I'm going to go talk to Grandpa and see what he's got to say. What do you got to say, Grandpa? He ignores me. Uh, one of these days, Grandpa, you're going to be sorry. You're going to be sorry that you ignored your grandchildren. And the years all pass by and bad stuff happens. I don't know. Um, okay. Let's keep going down. Let's keep going down in the fastest way as possible. Continue. Now then, map. That is a stairway up. The stairway down is over here, isn't it? Yes. All right. We can handle that. We can also grab that silver. Because I guess that is something that uh, was left on the ground when I was walking my way back up here. Um, Alright, this floor is pretty much squared away. Stairs down over there and stairs down up there. We have a variety of different places we can go. Let's go to some of them. Well, let's go to one of them. Let's pick. Oh, let's fight a brown bear. Combat! It's been weeks. You know, because I haven't been playing this game. So it has been weeks since I had combat. Also, I apparently never bothered to uh, sleep before I left town because I still have mana points that I need to recover. But now I don't. Excellent. Most excellent. Uh, ooh, it's Bo, everybody, the wolf man. I hit the wolf man even though he clawed me one time. Ooh. Wolf man, bro, is putting up a fight, baby. I don't know what I did, but put me back in the party. Oh, forget that, friggin' ghost. Don't tell me the ghost is still here, isn't it? Yeah, it is. I'm gonna use electricity magic on myself. That's how much I hate this ghost. I lost mana. That's actually one of the best things a Pale Wraith can do to me. Great. Now I feel stupid. Just stop it. Stop it. Okay, he stopped it. Let's rest for a while. Okay, let's not rest. Let's fight a bear. The other day I saw a bear. A great big bear. Oh, way up there. The other day I saw a bear, a great big bear, away oh, up there. Okay, let's save the game. And let's look at the map again. And certainly we will find something somewhere. Dungeon 4, a large bag, no large iron shield, no broken door, sword. S word. Swords. Okay, and was there stuff here? Dungeon floor in a bag, a dungeon floor in a cloak. Let's go see what's up with these 
items. Let's uh, identify this item that's on the ground. It is a cloak. It's a wool cloak. I don't feel like that's that important. I don't know about you guys. Inside the bag is a chest. Inside the chest is a bag. Inside the bag is a belt. No. But at the same time, nothing interesting here. Let's close the one quiver belt too. Okay. I hate you smirking sneak thieves. You knew that though. I resist the attack because I've got a magic pendant. I got a spear of magic helmet. Alright, we've got more things. We've got copper. We've got silver. And okay, so that's all we got. That's enough though. What more do you people want from me? Whoa, that is the most metal shield ever. Anything in the bag? No, nothing in the bag. What? Why do I have just piles of c copper in my chest? Oh, because I put them in there and not in my purse. That was on me, folks. Ah, let's save the game and let's go to sleep. Oh no, it's that guy, Luftrenzir or whatever. Yeah, I do kind of feel like I need to review the basic goals of the game because it's been so long. Um, I believe what we're trying to do is find a magic shield that... No, it's a magic hammer, I think, that controls the weather. I think that's what it is, anyway. And some crazy magician or trickster or somebody has stolen it. And uh, I'm the king. Or, you know, I come from royal lineage, so that's not cool to me. Let's grab this wand. Let's kill this carrion creeper. Let's grab this scroll. That's a good scroll. And a trap. Let's disarm it. Hey, remember this part of the game, folks? Exploring the invisible dungeons. The invisible dungeons with wolves being led by an injured wolf man who's gonna send his white wolves after you. The wolf man sees you and growls something in the language of his wolf arm, the wolf lupin brothers. Probably the word ah. As one of the wolves begin to slink towards you with death in their eyes and saliva dripping from their slavering jaws, baby. You're pretty sure the translation and prepare to meet their attack. Ah, Alright. So let's uh, fight these wolves. So far, not so bad. Hobgoblin, not really doing very much. You know how the hobgoblins go. Hobgoblin, you just need to back off. Alright. So, we actually just encountered Wolfman boss character. Uh, let's see what he had in his little bag. He had a potion. He had a scroll. No, in the chest. Thank you. Using a touch, using a uh, touchpad instead of my mouse, I probably should just go find my mouse. Anyhow, um, so there you go, baby. We've invaded the chamber of the Wolfman. So that's cool. That's a way to return, huh? Um, so on the next episode of Let's Play Castle of Winds Part Two, we'll do some more fun stuff like this. I'm Boba the Vulture. Thanks very much for watching. Bye-bye.